Welcome to Benj Washington for the 2020 MDT Steel Challenge. This is the National Rifle League's fifth match of the 2020 season, hosted by Jake Vibbert, first time match director John Pinch, and presented by MDT. Jake returns to match direct his fourth NRL season with the help of former NRL champion John Pinch. This is a staple match that includes a one-of-a-kind stage where competitors must engage targets from a flying helicopter. Due to intense weather conditions, day one of the competition was not filmed as competitors faced fierce winds and rain. With a legendary match and many talented shooters coming to compete, the drive to win is extremely high. You're watching the 2020 MDT Steel Challenge. Jake Vibber here from Washington State. One thing I like about this stage is it makes you think. All the stages are completely different. Hi, I'm Regina Milkovich. I'm from Arizona. That was pretty challenging. I didn't think I was going to be able to finish that well. So, so far, it's been a fun match. Carson Rutherford from Elk City, Oklahoma. I'm at the Heat Stroke Open. It was pretty difficult. High wins, fast mover. Heading into day two, the weather clears and the squad continues at stage one. If you're, if you're buckling them in, make sure it's hot, instruct them how they can. And then as these guys are coming up, really quickly, next two guys, have them staged, ready to go. Hey, are you the next shooter? Whoever it is, stand right by me until we're ready, you know? Don't let them wander off so you're yelling at them, okay? As soon as this helicopter starts coming back, get everything ready and, and going so that they all know. They're coming off. You guys are entering the front of the chopper and going from there. Any other questions? No. Okay. More coffee. Your bags, 30 rounds. Don't overload them or you might jam. So I, I, Give me old tan. Open up all those boxes, too, so you guys aren't fishing out of one. All right, so who, it, first up is out of you today. First up is Alan and Hey Alan. Oh god damn the camera. Put your headset on. Come on. You're good. There you go. Headset. Yes, sir. 
really fun times. I mean, you get to ride a helicopter, shoot targets out of it. It's not as easy, but it's not super, you know, it, it, it was, uh, you had to earn those hits. Um, yeah, I mean, there's, you know, not a lot of matches where you can do this, have this much fun. And uh, yeah, so yesterday was a little bit tough with the, with the weather and hopefully stays dry today and hopefully the wind stays up. So. How many no, times? You have to move to prone, it says. So it doesn't say off the, just off the tank track. Oh, middle one. tank track. Yeah. Middle of the track traps start with. Yeah, middle tank. Or on the prone. Most everybody's just starting on the tank trap and then going prone. So where All is the right, spinner? Gather around. It's right there. See the, the little clear spot right down the bottom? Yeah, I was going to oh, go. Yeah, we already got one. Yeah, we already got one. Same on that as that one, but don't, don't listen to him because it switched on him and he's pissed. Did you mulligan it? No. What'd you get? Seven. Oh, you did? I just seen you miss the last two, that's all I know. I was holding that same wind. Wait, no. And I didn't see it. Yeah, yeah, one three and one three. Yeah. Yeah. Or one four one. The last four. two targets I do think are the same wind hold. Yeah. I do too. They were for me. Yep. Well, good luck. Go, burn Go get them. Uh, also, I have double plug. Can you yell really loud for me, okay. please? You understand, course fire? Yeah. Okay, shooter ready? Yep. Stand by. Go! Yeah, just drop it off to a, a 12 after the first target. After the first one? Yeah. Shave two. Yep. 
Jake too. My name is Morgan Kane from Kaysville, Utah. We just shot the, uh, we got five different uh, animal targets from close to, or from far to near. It started at like 700 and finished at about 200 yards off these, these stumps right here. Um, I needed to pick up some rounds or pick up some uh, points today. So hope I'm shooting a little bit better. Got a good clean on this one. So we'll see how the rest of the day goes, but so far so good.
right, guys, and we are here with our top lady, Killy Lily. Killy, congratulations. Thank you, thank you. Absolutely. So this match was a little bit of everything. Crazy weather, crazy stages. What was your favorite and what could you wish or what do you wish you could do again? Okay, so definitely my favorite was the color flip stage. Yes. I love stages like that. It makes your brain work in a different way. Um, you have to think pretty fast in a different way than you normally would. Um, if I could have done something different, oh man, that's really hard. That's tough. But it, it was a, a tough match this weekend and uh, there's a couple of things that I would have done different. Probably the blind stage. I probably would have redone the blind stage. That one was probably my, my worst stage. That was your nemesis? Oh yeah, that one for sure. So not only did you come out here and win top lady, but you also came out with your husband and son. I did, yep. Yeah, so. Um, this weekend, actually, Mike shot in a different squad than I did, um, and that's that was a lot of fun. You know, we try and meet as many people as possible, but Aiden was tagging along with us, driving the racer, just having a blast with everybody. So I think it was really nice to have the whole family out here. Awesome. Well, congratulations you. on your big win. Thank you. And we can't wait to see you again soon. Yeah, me too. All right, guys, and we are here with our top young man, Jake Miller. Jake, congratulations. Thank you. So I had the opportunity of watching you shoot this weekend, and I was very impressed. Um, how was the match for you? Uh, cold, wet, windy. Cold, wet, and windy. Yep. That describes the weather. How'd you shoot? Obviously, uh, besides taking top place. Pretty good overall. Uh, dropped a few points I shouldn't have. What was your favorite stage this weekend? Helicopter. Helicopter? Yep. <laughs> Is that your first time shooting out of a helicopter? No, second. Second time? Yep. But still your favorite? Yes. Awesome. So what does the rest of your season look like? Matches. A lot of matches. How many matches are you guys planning to shoot this year? 17, maybe more. And that includes team matches? And is that with your teammate Nick Godarzy? Yep. Is that that guy right there? Yep, that guy right there. <laughs> hey, maybe let's get Nick in here. Come on, Nick. Come on, Nick. So th th this is Nick Godarzy. It's safe to say he's your, your coach? Yep. It's safe to say? No. No? No. Co ice cream. Co-partner? Co-partner, yeah. Ice Co cream leader. Ice cream leader? Yeah. So Nick is also a, one of our NRL champions, top competitor, helping uh, Jake here along the lines. Now one of our champions as well, second time champion, right? Yep. So congratulations to both of you. Thank you. Great job. Good job, coach. All right, buddy. Sorry yeah, you came Jake. in third loser, but or whatever it was. Some of us have to be losers. <laughs> <laughs> but we got a champion right here. Yep. <laughs> All right, guys, we are here at the 2020 MDT Steel Challenge, brought to you by JC Steel Targets in Benj, Washington. And we had a phenomenal match. I mean, it literally came down to the wire. And Dan Bernicini of California came out on top. Dan, congratulations. Hey, thank you, Travis. Thank you. Oh, it was tough because yesterday was miserable. I mean, with the weather, rain in our face, high winds. I mean, it was just survival. And I remember shooting this match back in 2017. It was a survival match, and, and that's how it was this weekend. And I just knew I had to make up a lot of points uh, today and just basically tried to miss as few as possible and, and burn it down. So. Well, you shot phenomenally well. I think the difference between you and second place was only one point. One point. And you guys were in the same squad, correct? Uh, he or was a squad ahead. ahead. Yeah, he was a squad ahead of us, and I knew he said he he beat me on the tiebreaker, so yeah, if we would have tied, he would have got it. I knew we were tight, and, and I would have loved to see him win just as much as I did. So we knew we were tight, and yeah, it was just, it came to the last shot. So it was such a, it was, it was a good match. That's so awesome. And this was your first NRL match of this, uh, of this year? First NRL match of this year. Uh, other ones, you know, got canceled, and yeah. Super, COVID. Yeah, COVID. <laughs> super stoked to, uh, yeah, be shooting, and uh, it, was, it was a good match. So. Awesome. Congratulations, man. I can't wait yeah. to see the rest Thank of the you. season. Thank you. I wish you the best of luck, and it's always so much fun watching you shoot. It was fun. This concludes the 2020 MDT Steel Challenge. Congratulations to Mr. Dan Bertaccini for taking first place in the match. The NRL would also like to congratulate Morgan King and Steve Ames for taking second and third in the match, as well as many other great competitors close behind them. Thank you to the match directors, ROs, sponsors, competitors, and everyone else who helped make this match possible. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe to stay up to date on all NRL news and content. As always, stay safe. Keep shooting and we'll see y'all next time.